guys hope you all are doing well in today's video i will be taking you to kurnool city in andhra pradesh where you will see konda ready fort which is also known as kurnool fort before i get into the video and share history and visuals of the fort i want to take this opportunity to thank you for the love and support that you guys are showing to my young channel it inspires me to bring new and interesting content to you also in case you haven't subscribed yet please do so by clicking the subscription button and hit the bell icon to get the notification with that out of the way let's start with today's video kurnool fort is an imposing structure situated in the heart of kurnool city and it establishes the historical importance of kurnool town in andhra pradesh as you view the fort from the street it looks much smaller than other forts that you may have seen in the past however its multiple level structure gives it an interesting look konda ready fort is a unique monument due to its singular feature of an underground tunnel which connects the fort of gadwal a place 52 kilometers away the most remarkable feature of this tunnel is that it passes under the river tungabhadra a feat unimaginable during the medieval times the fort is a proof of the architectural acumen and astute military strategies characteristics of the medieval rulers of india the tunnels are now locked and closed off from the public but the fort is open to touring The fort has three levels and it was used as watchtower in 17th and 18th centuries. The ground level is closed for visitors while the visitors can climb to the remaining floors and get a glimpse of the history. First level has few enclosures and large portico with horseshoe shaped arcs. A very narrow staircase which is wide enough for just one person will take you to the second level. which has a defensive wall shaped as arches you will note that the wall has holes which was probably used to keep an eye on the fort perimeter and shoot arrows or bullets at the enemy to defend the fort further the stairs will take you to the top level that houses a large tower that was used for observation from here you will note that the fort is on a busy street with a road passing next to it from the top you notice how the past and present are coexisting side by side here the construction of the fort dates back to the 12th century when the city of kurnool was used as a base On Tungabhadra River crossing, Kurnool was occupied by Vijayanagar ruler Devaraja II, who built the initial fort between 1530 and 1542. The fort has different gateways and bastions. The gateway of the fort were constructed by Gopala Raja, the grandson of Rama Raja of Telikota Vijayanagar kings in the 17th century. The fort is named after Kunda Reddy, the last ruler of Alampur. was imprisoned in the fort by the Kurnool Nawab in the 17th century locals and legend state that Konda Reddy was under attack and used the underground tunnels that i mentioned earlier to escape Konda Reddy eventually escaped from the fort but he had to lose his territory to Golconda Nawabs the entry to the fort for visitors is free although the fort is small its architecture is impressive surrounded by streets and traffic This is a little piece of Indian history that you must visit in case you are in Kurnool. And that's it folks. Do hit like button if you like the video. I will soon bring to you another video from my visit to Kurnool. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel in case you do not want to miss that and other videos. This is your travel buddy Anindita signing off. Take care and God bless.